Hello, this is a dedication shave. Uh, this one's for you, Spence. So I hope you enjoy. I'll see you after the titles. So I've been uh, wanting to do this video for a while and uh, eventually getting around to doing it. So uh, as I said, Spence, hope you enjoy. It's some uh, products that, um, that I'm going to be using that's inspired by Spencer. Uh, Spencer's been making um, shave videos for about eight months now. I think he's been shaving for about two years, around about two years. And uh, I really enjoy his videos. He's very enthusiastic. Uh, he's got a great smile and uh, he's really positive. Um, he's got some great products. Um, sometimes uh, he does go back to sort of basic shaves, but um, his shaves are going more towards uh, the sort of middle to high end products. So, uh, as I say, I hope, I hope uh, you enjoy Spence, what I've uh, chosen for you. Uh, the razor. I'm going to be using is the uh, supply razor. This is version 2 in chrome. And the blade has got six shaves on it at the moment, so this will be the seventh one. And uh, I'll just show you a little clip that um, uh, Spence mentioned me in, in his video. Um, he was uh, sort of encouraging me to uh, get the supply razor, so I'll uh, stop talking and you can see the video now. In a good way. That's why I prefer it. But if you've got really sensitive skin, then you might want to have a look at the supply razor. I see Stephen the Suffolk shaver is considering buying one. But hopefully that goes through, mate. I think you really like it. It knocks down day's growth easy. Because these blades are so thick, coarseness is not an issue. No matter how coarse your skin is, it's not going to struggle. Yeah, so uh, on that on that video, I did go ahead. Um, Connaught shaving here in the UK uh, was out of stock of them. At the time, so uh, and the Canuck Shaver had a um, discount code for a supply razor, so uh, I went ahead and purchased it, and I'm um, very much enjoying the shaves. Uh, the brush I'm using, this will be the last time, and then I'll be using uh, some other brushes. This is the uh, Massetto, again, that was uh, Spencer that inspired me to get a Massetto brush. I was watching his video where he last mentioned uh, these uh, brush makers and um, I just looked on eBay and uh, there was one which was this one for £25 including uh, shipping. So uh, look at the fucking gel tips on that <laughs> as Spencer says. So uh, yeah that's been uh, soaking or blooming so uh, it should got the moisture out. So, is a soap that uh, I mentioned to Spencer and I bought from um, Shaving Station so uh, thanks um, Stuart at uh, Shaving Station for stocking this one it's a Razor Master Ulla, I think that's how you pronounce it it's a coffee scented soap um, I saw this one on um, Michael Friedberg video, he'd done a review on it it's a strong coffee scent with a um, chocolate sort of note to it and it comes on this sort of uh, paper or wax paper. Uh, they did just generally come like this but uh, I think Stuart Shaver Station has um, stuck them in these uh, little tins. I'll show you the back of the soap. It says have a nice shave. These ones are made in Finland, I believe. I'll just say they're like right, big letters, what a dope. And that's the uh, ingredients, 80 grams there. So hopefully I can take these stickers off and uh, put the stickers onto the tin. 
So let's try that. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work. Oh. Yeah, it's come off nicely there, so I'll stick that on the tin. And yeah, so that's a soft sort of soap. So I'm going to place that in the tin. That's a little bit smaller than the tin, so I'll probably press that down at a later, later date. It's not an overpowering scent. It's not, you know, it's not like eight or nine. It's probably a, maybe about a four, but uh, once I lather it might, you know, increase the strength. And post shave I'm using is uh, Barristrom Man Leviathan, which is uh, leather, coffee and sandalwood. My top, top, uh, Barrister Man soap at the moment, or scent. So, uh, let's start this shave. And I've done my hair as well, look, I've wetted it and combed it, and it's all fucked up at the back there, like, <laughs> like Spence does it. It's all nice at the front there, but he's, <laughs> he forgets about the back. Just dip the tips. It's more than a dip. So I've never used this uh, Razor Master soap before. Um, it's not a bad price, it's £12.50 at uh, Shaven Station. So it's a big knot on this brush, so uh, load it heavy. Yeah, Spencer's uh, <clears throat> one channel I sort of keep on top of. Because he's always got really good content. Uh, unlike some of us, he, he keeps his uh, videos short. Let's go with that and then see. I could always go back again and get some more. The coffee and the cocoa or chocolate note. It's a great combination. happy with this brush. You may have heard me if you were there on uh, Sunday. If you were, thank you very much. Really enjoy the uh, live shakes on Sunday. Just another one, and I'll keep my eye on another sort of style that they do. And I looked this morning, and uh, the dreaded two words, one left. I went, Ugh! purchase. If I knew that was the last one, then I'd have ordered the two together and. Saved a little bit, but I'm 
in pre-shave today, just uh, just recently had a shower anyway, so you see getting good coverage. Obviously it's a, a smaller puck than uh, like the four ounce ones we get which is a, a great sort of size for uh, a surface you know to load the brush so it's the seventh shave on this blade and I've got me a vest on as well look for uh, Spencer. Spencer also likes uh, having a coffee on uh, when he's having his shaves and uh, occasionally he likes to have a, a nice whiskey. See the whiskers coming off there. Focus. And this razor with the uh, two dot setting. Is a sort of very mild, but um, it could be a little, a little bit more efficient. But uh, I guess that's the uh, three dot one. It's available in four finishes, and uh, go to getsupply.com. A very long conversation with uh, Sitsi Shaves over the weekend, and um, speaking to him, I uh, realised I've not got many um, sort of products for a budget shave, so be looking in to get some. Uh, Shaving sticks. I've got the uh, palm olive sticks. I've got three sort of um, grated into a plastic tub. I've got a uh, Wade Scuttle, which I got from uh, eBay for, I think it was about £5. So I've got um, another different shaving stick to uh, put into that.
Okay, good first pass. Just uh, wash my face here if I've got any slickness on my skin. Um, and then get some fresh water in the sink and I'll see you in a second. All right, we're back for the second pass. Wasn't too much uh, slickness on the skin. I've had a uh, slicker, but and I've also gone back to the tub and put a little bit more on the brush. So hopefully now I've got enough for uh, the second pass and the, anything else after that. This will be the cross the grain. Really loving this scent. As I said, it's not a sort of a in-your-face kind of scent. But you get sort of a whiffs of it as you're applying the lather to your face. Not sure if this soap is uh, available anywhere else. Um, might be something to uh, look into. It's got some uh, other scents. I'll probably be looking to buy it at some point. Yeah, there's slickness there. Perhaps I, for the first pass, I sort of underloaded the brush. It's a dedication video. I may uh, sort of do one a month if I get uh, sort of inspired by somebody else, and I've got products that uh, they use. Spencer still works for a coffee shop. But he's uh, trying to get an apprenticeship for uh, plumbing. I think he's sort of getting odd jobs here and there to give him some experience. If you've uh, not checked out Spencer's channel, 
go over and uh, subscribe. It's Spencer Frankel. He's uh, on his way to 500 subscribers. Got that weep there again, had that Sunday. So the razor is very ergonomic, so it feels good in the hand, it's got a good weight to it. I think the, um, this mirrored finish, or chrome, and the uh, jet black are the best ones, in my opinion anyway. It's uh, not easy to see in a tiny little screen. I think if I wasn't um, filming, I'd be able to see in a full size mirror. So just take out what I've got left in the brush. A little bit of water there, but you get that with the uh, badger brushes. Great scent. So, and the slickness is okay. Spencer likes to buff as well. That's a sh shaving term, by the way. <laughs> and the uh, Barrister Men aftershave or splash has um, witch hazel in it, so. So we'll skip that, that part. So one more, just uh, rinse with cold water now. That weep is uh, gone now. It sort of comes and goes.
I'll just show you the uh, ingredients on the bottle. Do that with chasel up the top there. Second row down. So give it a bit of a shake. Let's just say it's a Leviathan from Barrister of Man, leather, coffee, and sandalwood. Got uh, good restrictors on these. So you don't have to put your finger over the ends like you do with some others. Oh. Might put a balm on later on, but uh, for now, what I smell like coffee. Some more actually. It's a yellowy browny colour. Spencer likes to do that. I don't know how he does it, but. So, I uh, hope you enjoyed that, Spencer. I enjoyed uh, eventually getting around to making this video. As I said, I've had the soap for a while and uh, been very keen to use it. And uh, obviously with the brazier and the brush as well. So, uh, let's say thanks for, your, thanks for your likes, thanks for your comments. Any questions, leave them in the comments box below. Uh, subscribe if you've not subscribed so far and click the bell icon for future, future notifications. And uh, yeah, have some great shaves, have a great week. And uh, be positive, as um, Spencer says, and make someone smile. And uh, I'll see you later in the week for another shave. Cheers, bye. Sorry, I left again without going for the styles as a shave, didn't I? Can't do that. It's the uh, version two. It's the chrome supply razor, single edge, with the injector blade. The brush was Masetto 2 band, 30ml knot. The soap is uh, just to go out the middle. The uh, Eula, the coffee scented, is a uh, Razor Master from uh, Finland. And the uh, Splash was a Barrister Man Leviathan, uh, leather, coffee, and sandalwood. So uh, leave it be now and uh, see you next time. Cheers, bye. Yeah.